The EJ22 is finally going in the bug and this is the process of cutting a hole to fit the turbo. I'll be releasing the full episode next week, so stay tuned, but for now, enjoy the violence. This is the fuel line though, so make sure this is well out of the way. I also needed to make a few cuts in the car as well. Once that was done, I pulled out the now scrap metal to make room for the turbo. All right, that hole's cut. Looks pretty good. I think that's about where I wanted it. Uh, I went too far on a couple places right there and then really bad on the inside. Uh, because I was trying to watch the camera angle instead of my cut, which is not a great idea. But you can see uh, right here, I went too far uh, as well. Um, eh, not as bad as I first thought, but that should fit the turbo. Let's try it out. All right, we're looking good, but we need this uh, heater hose out of the way because that's where the downpipe's gonna go. Let's give that a yank. Uh-oh. That's okay. Next. It's looking pretty good. Plenty of room for the downpipe to sneak in there. This is just one of the things that you have to do to make a turbo Subaru engine fit in a bug, and there's still lots more to get done. This has actually been one of the most fun projects I've ever worked on, and I can't wait to start making progress on it again. It'll have to wait though, because the Talon is top priority right now. I'm going to build that car into a killer daily driver, and it's gonna be super fun. I'm currently working on the Talon and getting a bunch of those videos queued up, and this full video of the EJ22 install will be out next week, so stick around, there's lots more on the way.